have all of my normal good like nail stuff. So look at this. <laughs> <laughs> Why are those for babies? Do, 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 do. They're so small. <laughs> That's going to cover like one nail. I know. Okay, so we have this like silver. Oh, sorry. Wait, hold on. Yes, yes. We have this silver color, like gunmetal gray kind of deal. Okay. And then we yeah. have this, which reminds me of what you guys have been painting your yeah. nails as. We can yeah, kind of. So I can do both, or you can tell me what color you like better. Mm, I'm doing, I'm going to do, I literally had to do math for fingers. I'm going to do <laughs> eight fingers <laughs> with this uh -huh. blue, and then I'm going to do two with this pink. And I think Joe's oh, going to do cute. all pink. Yeah. Yes. Very no, spring. I love that. I like yes. And do fun stuff. I don't have a lot of fun colors. I also don't have all my nail stuff with me, so it's kind of a bummer, but. Yeah, like, like I have dotting tools and glitter and. Dotting tools? What's a dotting tool? Are you even a beauty guru, Frankie? <laughs> no, <laughs> clearly. We're sitting on the floor. Um, you, like, you like make like nail art. Did you ever, oh my gosh, everyone, let me know if you watch Cute Polish on YouTube. Did you guys watch Cute Polish? No. Oh, oh man. Kate <laughs> Rinders is here. <gasps> Hi, 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 Kate Rinders. Rinders. Hi. I miss you. You should be here. You should be here. All right, I'm going to get started, Jude, while you tell me about your, um, your, what were you telling me? <laughs> I don't even know. Oh, your dotting, dotting your tools? No, it, it's literally is. just like a thing to make polka dots with. It's boring. I don't, yeah. No, I'm so sorry. I'm like covering your face no, completely. I don't care. This I, is going to be a I mess. Start doing it, what have I, you guys I've been never, up to? Literally I'm, nothing, Jude. <laughs> nothing. Like we wake up and it's like, I don't know. We kind of just stare at each other and waiting for the other one to say something first. Yeah. Oh, he's shaking it. He's a oh, beauty guru. Wow. He's done this that. before. Um, um, my mom gave me this fancy, like, nail file, and she said if I drop it, it'll shatter. So. Wow. She's like, it's from Gucci. I know. It's a Gucci nail um, file. Already, I've already painted my fingers, not my, oh my gosh, I can't do this. I'm going to do it like this. You can't even see um, me. Um, yeah, yeah. Have you guys been that. watching anything recently? Um, yesterday we started the first episode of America's Next Top Model, like the first OG. Um, you, yes, on Hulu, like, right? Right? Yes. It's Duh. like, it, and I was, I was just laughing because I was like, this is the rogue of like reality television. Like they didn't even have body mics. Like you can barely hear them. Like the yes. wind is blowing into like the cameras. It's terrible. But I, I love it. I love it. it. Um, we've been watching that. We started um, season eight of Drag Race. That was good. Oh, go off. And then, um, that's I think that's, we're watching something. What else are we watching? Shiz Creek. Oh, uh, I need to watch Real that. Housewives. Oh, Real Housewives, both Bev mm -hmm. Hills and New York. Yes. Um, Drag Race. Although not the current season. I'm, I was newly introduced to Drag Race Sorry. a few months ago, and I'm a fan now, but I have to, I, he won't let me watch the current season until I am caught up with previous seasons, because he said I won't get jokes. Yeah, because they like, mm -hmm. the other queens guest star and stuff, so you want to, it's fun when you know who they are. I gotcha. Yeah. What are you watching? Wentworth. You know me so well. Um, also, I post about it on Twitter all the time. So, um, yeah, Wentworth, um, my dad, and oh, I guess my whole family, we all watched that new show on Netflix, Unorthodox, Ooh. which was so good. I don't know. I'm interested to see, like, uh, what people think of it if they're not Jewish, because I'm, we're, like, full Jewish, and it's, like, very, like, I like understand it, so I don't. I don't know how like. Well, I am not are, Jewish, like. Jewish, I know. <laughs> I will watch it and I will report back. Yeah, because it's very, it's very like. I mean, they speak in Yiddish basically the whole time, so I don't know if that's like. Whatever. Is it subtitles. But, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Um. Don't you have a show on Netflix? Me? Oh. Um. I my animated show. Yeah. 
Ah, yeah, it's called Spirit. <laughs> Spirit. Is there any relation to the Beyonce song Spirit from The Lion King? Oh, man, I wish. <laughs> Everyone, when I tell people what it is, they all they all know, is it like, is it a play on the horse spirit? Which I'm like, yes. Everyone thinks I play a horse. Didn't you think I played a horse? I thought you played a horse. Because there is a movie so funny. Spirit with a horse that talks, right? Yeah, it's like loosely based on that. Okay. Well, yeah. then how come in the movie, the horses talked and then in your show, <laughs> they don't talk? Okay, yes. honestly, um, I think I'm doing a really good job. Let me see. <gasps> That's <laughs> so cute. I'm not doing, oh, actually, no, look at that. That looks fantastic. What a mess. Can you tell the story of when we went our, and got our nails done in Georgia? So, <laughs> Julie and I were just in Georgia, you know, as two people find As themselves. we do. And I was like, I really want to get my nails done. And she was like, okay, so I looked up, like, spa, whatever, and we went to this random place that was near a ho our hotel and the it, it when it was all said and done it was just horrible julia's gels had completely lifted off of her nail and they were just like floating it was so weird it was, it was the terrible. worst manicure i've ever gotten but and it was said, so expensive it was so expensive and it was expensive for no reason yeah. but then i let them grow out and they were kind of chipping and of course, I didn't have time. So Good Morning America, <laughs> the cast of High School Musical, I have like chipped nails. It's so embarrassing. We love to see it. But you know what? I'm a survivor. Yeah, I'm a survivor. I'm going to make it. What did Absolutely. you, um, what are your favorite quarantine snacks, Juji? Oh my gosh. Well, um, currently burning a hole in my stomach with how much talking. <laughs> <laughs> Talkies and um, let's see. I oh my gosh, we've been eating so much peanut butter. Us peanut too, butter, actually. it's so peanut butter toast, peanut butter on crackers, peanut butter with celery, peanut butter's on a waffle. Ooh, like an ego waffle. You know, I'm like a chef. Yeah, you it's know, like have you cooked job. anything? That's been the hardest thing about this. <laughs> is like having to cook. I. I cannot, I, I hate cooking. No, I'm literally, I'm living with my parents. So they are. You're so lucky. Cooking. I know. I, I am kind of nervous um, to know what I would be eating if I were alone. Um, I'll tell you what you will, what you would be eating. Um, Lucky Charms, um, Honey Nut Cheerios, <laughs> um, a lot of candy for some reason, a lot, <laughs> a lot of candy. Um, tacos. Ooh, taco like Taco Bell tacos or just tacos? Um, there's oh. been a few Taco Bell tacos. Um, but honestly, oh, and I made meatballs the other day, like at 1 a.m. because I was starving. Wait, but... like frozen meatballs or you made meatballs? Oh, they were good meatballs, though. I had one. <laughs> so, yeah. Yum. Duh. Thank you. Everyone's I love that. I'm the next Beyonce. People are saying I'm the next Beyonce? They're right. Who? Show me the facts. <laughs> Julia, do you remember like the first, I think it was like the first weekend we were in, we got to Utah, me, you and Sophia went to go get our nails done. Yeah, that was literally like two days after we moved there. That was so nice. I missed Aww. that. Yeah. And then the next time I went with um, Dara and Josh. Josh and Josh, oh my gosh. Yes. He gets them cleaned that. up. He does. We love a boy with clean nails. Yes. All right. How are you doing? Because this is already chunky. Um, you see that? It's already clumping. Um, I think we're doing well. Wow. That's, you've already used all your nail polish. I know. It's literally gone. Um, I'm wondering if I'm going to do these three with this color and then these two with the gray. And then do these three with the gray and these two with the green. Mm. Does you know what I mean? Love the smell of nail polish. No, it smells like poison. I love it. <laughs> I love the smell of gasoline. I LOL. I, I like the smell of gasoline too. Yeah. That's not okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's comforting in a way. I don't know why. Julia, were you a pyro as a kid? 
Oh my Absolutely. God, Joe. Absolutely. I used to go in the backyard with a magnifying glass and burn holes in leaves. <laughs> That's not yeah. normal. I used to take the matchbox outside and just light things on fire. Perhaps we shouldn't do it. give people ideas I love that. when they're home alone. And oh, sorry, everyone. Do. Uh, maybe don't um, play with fire. No, you shouldn't play with fire. That's true. Oh my gosh. How do we get here? All right, I've done my first co, I think. Let me see. I don't think it's very good, but, you know, we do our best. How did you do all 10 nails already? What? I'm only on the fourth nail. I learned from a really good person. Oh my person gosh, and look at this. Alarm. That is still <laughs> chipping. Oh man. I watched her mastery on my nails before. Oh my gosh. Rebecca, I miss you. Miss you, Julia. You look great. Oh, thank so you. <laughs> yeah, here, show you. Joe's going to show off his nails. Go off. Oh, shit. It's okay. I closed it before. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Sorry. I'm, I'm making a real scene out of this. What's new? <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. Oh, I love them. Just like. I love them so much. For some reason, I was waiting for more audience reactions, but then I realized I'm the only person here. <laughs> That was really strange. I was like waiting for like, ooh. I don't know why. <laughs> That's what I, uh, when we started this, it was kind of weird that um, there's no sound back. Right? It feels like we're just FaceTiming. Yeah. But yeah. Um, do the second coat. People are asking who tough. Rebecca is. Rebecca is my roommate and she, oh, <laughs> you can't see now, but there was a picture of her on the wall. Um, She's very fun and she's very cool. Um, she's both of those things. Also, Julia, people are asking for movie recommendations on Disney Plus. What's the last oh. movie you watched on Disney Plus? Our show, because I rewatch it sometimes, a lot of times. Um, anyway, uh, maybe. Let's see. Patrick Dougal said, Hi, Rebecca. I saw that. Hi, Patrick. Hi, Pat. Do you guys know if Cowbells is on Disney Plus? I think it is because it was okay. on um, Disney Channel, right? Yes, everyone. Um, that's my recommendation: is Cowbells. That movie slaps. I restarted Phil of the Future. Oh, yeah. They just put that up, didn't they? I think so. You know what other oh movie? My um, oh my goodness, which it was also. I just watched it. It's the one about the the girls who live or the girl who lives in the suburb, but she wants to be a songwriter and then she meets Stuck up. in the suburbs. Stuck in the suburbs. <laughs> yes. The okay, you know the the like one of the very first scenes in the beginning where they're all like in the living room and they're dancing and then they go on top of the couch and tip it over? Yes. It like is like literally two seconds. I used to want to do that so badly. I was like, I'm going to get a group of friends together and we're going to dance in my living room and do that to our couch. And like, not even thinking about the fact that my mom would have probably murdered me. Your poor mother. I know. I can't even imagine so trying much. to raise you, Julia. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm oh. going to let this hand dry. I finished one hand. That, okay. The thumb is actually not bad. I would hire oh, you to she's paint cute. the thumb. Thank you. Yeah. We're Thank close. You. I'm doing the like weird pattern thing. Larry re requested that I draw a pop star on every single fingernail. But what Larry doesn't understand is I can barely <laughs> paint these fingernails. <laughs> Honestly, I would love to see you attempt it. Um. Um, no. Uh, comment in the comments below. <laughs> What's the thing you miss the most about life, Juge? You. Oh. Suck up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, no, truly though, our cast. I and know. It's been our fun. show. Um, it's been really weird, but very grateful for technology because we can do things like this. I know. This is so fun. Yeah. Um. That and also eating at restaurants. I know. I didn't realize how much I liked like being at a restaurant. Yeah, like I, I would like go. Brunch. Huh? I we miss um, 
like brunch. I miss brunch oh. so much. Yes. But it's okay. We can yeah. make it. We attempted to make it here and we set off the smoke alarm like a few, I know. <laughs> few dozen times. That was a good time. I don't want to hear anything from anyone about me being a master chef. Do you see this? Do you see this? I Everyone's always like, oh my God, Joe's so nice. <laughs> Joe's so nice. Do you see this? Yeah, right. Listen, I set off the fire alarm making bacon in the oven, and I think it just is because the grease dripped somewhere onto the oven. And Oof. It and it burned. So the Amazon order has been put in for... This is a long story. <laughs> cleaning the oven. Wow. Um, Look at don't you. you worry. Somebody asked what your new sleep schedule is, Jude. Um... Honestly, it varies, but I've been going, so, like, we all wind down at around, like, 11, usually, so everyone goes in their rooms, and the lights are off and everything, but I haven't been falling asleep until, like, mm, 2 a.m., and then I wake up at mm, 2 p.m. <laughs> there was one day I woke up at 4 p.m., and no. I was like, how did this happen to me? I love that for you. Honestly, Thank like, you. Going to, like, sleeping during the day or waking up in the middle of the day, something about it, it feels like you wake up in a dream. And I yeah, honestly I don't like Oh. I don't I like, like it. wasted a day, even though when I'm <laughs> awake, I would just sit down and waste the day anyway. <laughs> True. True. My body's um, going to hate me going back to a normal schedule. I know. I don't know what we're supposed to do when we have to wake up at, like... 6 a.m., which isn't even, that's like a normal morning hour. I told Joe, I was like, going back to a schedule is either going to be the most fun thing ever, or it's going to be this, like the worst Absolute thing torture. to have done to our bodies. Yeah. Um, honestly, though, like, I think when we're all back together, our energy is just going to like skyrocket because I'm like working on not working, um, living off of like 0% energy right now. So, <laughs> um, when we go back to Salt Lake, I feel like I'm just going to be like, pew, like so much energy. Like a, like a bottle rocket. Yeah. What do you mean zero energy? Your parents are so much fun. Yeah. Uh, it's been <laughs> awesome. <laughs> How is it going? Did you just do a second coat? Yes. I'm not even oh, done. You're so fast. I, I know, literally, literally. Just... Well, haste makes waste because I have nails <laughs> all over my fingers. <laughs> haste makes waste. Julia, did you notice <laughs> anything new when you watched the show this time around? Our show? Um, yes. Okay, wait. I think I actually might have told you this when I did watch it. But in the first episode, Nini calls her moms Mama C and Mama D. Oh, I don't I didn't notice that. Yeah, and I had no idea that she had, like, cute... I had no idea that she had, like, names for them like that, and I loved it. And it wasn't something that I caught before. I don't know if she says it again in the series, but in the beginning, she's like, Hi, Mama C. Aw, Mama D. And it's really cute. What's your favorite Ashlyn moment? And then what's your favorite, like, overall, just in general about the show? Oh, uh, um... I can tell you my favorite Ashlyn moment. I have a few with Ashlyn, though, to be honest. Aww. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, hold on. Wait, can I tell the story? So yeah. the first time I heard Wondering, I freaked out. I was like, this is the best thing to ever happen. And I thought it wasn't you singing at first. I thought it was like a, like a demo singer. A demo. But then I, I found out it was you. And I was like, okay, I'm obsessed. And then... Um, if we don't have access to other people's songs, but um, I wanted to hear it again. So I cornered Julia in her kitchen and I said, play me wondering. And we played it over and over. <laughs> it was so nice. Oh my gosh. The best. And then you recorded it on your phone. <laughs> me, me playing the music off of my phone. It's recorded like in your it. voice memos. <laughs> the best. So I still have the voice memo. You can hear us like breathing. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Um, okay, Aww. yeah, so what's your favorite Ashlyn moment? Aw, um, my favorite Ashlyn moment, um, I really like, um, I really like the scene in episode three when I'm with EJ, or sorry, episode two when I'm with, oh my god, is it two or three? 
two. I don't know. They kind of all. I'm the worst. At some point. Okay, it's either episode two or three. I'm standing at his locker, and he like asks me to take her phone, and Ashlyn just has like all these girl power clapbacks. Yes. And I felt really like powerful when I shot that scene. Yes. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. I do What's love our show. That is, uh, I do love that our show is very much about girl power. Yes, we love yeah. to see it. Um, what's your favorite, what are your guys' favorite moments of your characters? Um, let me see. Well, Julia, I haven't thought about this a lot, but I'm going to give you <laughs> a lot. Um, let me see. Um, favorite Carlos moments. I mean, obviously Homecoming is like, was one of the best days of like my career so far. Oh, yeah. Um, I remember just leaving that day and it felt like I couldn't go to sleep because the energy was still in me. Um, so obviously that whole thing is fun, but um, my favorite overall moment, I think would have to be the last two episodes watching everyone film the show within the show. Because oh, that's when I was, it was just so like, it was like Beyonce. I was like, this is, <laughs> what high school has this budget? It was insane. Oh, and it was so fun so to nice. watch. And um, I remember me and Kate were watching when the camera like would go past and then everyone's like bowing as the camera's going. And we were just like, this is on another level. It was so cool. That was so fun to watch. What about you? I love that. I love that your moment was not you. That's so <laughs> nice. Now I'm Oh my like, God. I'm like a really like good selfless. person. <laughs> <laughs> um my favorite Seb moment. Hopefully. Um <laughs> I don't know. So much of the time I was just so nervous about like what I was doing. Um, uh -huh. but I was I, I mean I loved obviously Stick to the Status Quo it was very fun. Too. That was epic yes. though. <laughs> like even like ripped pants and all and how sweaty I was like it was it didn't even matter it was just like mm -hmm. so thrilling oh that. that that reminds me my other favorite moment was that six is high school and actually um Alexis who plays Natalie Bagley for those that are watching she posted that whole thing about how Brent took your hand and like whatever that was one of my favorite days on set for those Aww. of you that don't know what I'm talking about um <laughs> when Joe was filming status quo being the perfect Sharpay that he is um our first AD Brent took his hand oh we were filming in front of an audience of like what 200 people like it was yeah. insane and um he took his hand and took him center stage and said like this is what like what was it this is what this is, like, 20, this is what 2019 like yeah we have a male sharpay like you're yeah. like this, you're looking right at the future and then like everyone screamed and cheered and i was so choked up <laughs> do you think there'll be like a um a thing where when high schools are doing high school musical they might consider sharpay as a boy now I mean, honest. If I were a theater teacher and I saw that, of, of course, why that not? Is, I think that is I think, so fresh. <laughs> I think <laughs> I love that. That is so fresh. Um, I'm gonna add wondering to my production of <laughs> high school. Yes. What if? What if they give like Miss Darvis a big old power ballad? Give her her power ballad. She deserves, she deserves it. it. Didn't you get to meet her? I did. She was, was that insane. She was so gracious and so nice it was so strange because like you guys know it wasn't like a huge press event like they literally just wanted us to meet and so nice I know and it was so beautiful the way that like Disney just wanted us to like like first generation Miss Darbus and then like I wouldn't say second generation Miss Darbus but I'll tr like I <laughs> my dream is to be that um, but like they had us meet and it was so nice and she was so gracious and she works in the like Los Angeles school district, um, like as a, like advocate for theater programs and oh, she's so like, a, cool. she's like a real life Miss Darbus and she loves theater and it was just amazing to meet her. I love yeah. that. Yeah. That's so nice. If you could meet anyone from the original movies, who would it be? I mean, Ashley Tisdale. I know. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I mean, ones that, I mean, when we, oh my gosh, when we met Monique at the premiere, yes. she was so nice. I, mean, honestly, I didn't know any of them. Yeah, literally any of them. All of them have been amazing. We've met, like, Corbin, and obviously Lucas was in season one, and everyone has just been so nice. Yeah. But um, Zach, where you be? 
where you I be know, at. where you be during this quarantine. I know. What do you think he's doing? I don't know. Probably. probably doing, like, what if he's doing an Instagram else. live with like someone else, like painting their nails? Right How now. Would that be? Yes. <laughs> Frankie would meet Zach. Ricky and Nini or Ricky and Gina? Ooh, I, that's I switch. I literally can't decide. I go based off whatever the episode tells me to like because honestly, yes. it's it's so yes, it's so many exactly. roller coasters. I'm like, okay, yeah. I ship this. I ship this. Yeah, no, I absolutely change. Joe, what episodes. happened? Do you think I need another coat? I don't think you need any more coats. What happened on the side here? <laughs> right there. There Look into the light. Look into the light. This is my first coat, everyone. How are we doing? How it's are we beautiful. Doing? Where I think are we you all, at in this process? We all did metallic, and I'm oh my gosh, I didn't even notice that. It's very <laughs> spring. <laughs> yes. Yes. Giving everyone good screenshot opportunities. Happy Easter. <laughs> Happy Easter. <laughs> Did you have a good holiday weekend? I mean, there's not really much you could have done. <laughs> yeah. Um, well, we celebrated Passover this Yay! week. Yay! Which was really nice. My dad is always, like, very passionate about Jewish holidays. So he went off and he did his whole Seder. It was beautiful. Oh. Um, and then... I've been watching so many tick. Okay, this is gonna sound weird. I'm watching so many TikToks of like parents dressing up as like scary Easter buddies and scaring their children. Oh my gosh, that's so sad. <laughs> it's so. Oh, yeah, it's so sad. <laughs> I hate being scared. That's what, <laughs> it's one of my worst fears is being scared. I know, but you know me. I like weird, scary things. I know. Literally, you in the corner watching Doctor Phil. Always. Always. <laughs> How's your Dr. Phil obsession? That's who we should get you to meet is Dr. Phil. I would die. You know, I've been to two of his tapings. Yes. What would a crossover episode look like with <laughs> Spirit, High School Musical, and Dr. Phil? Oh, my God. Um, Ashlyn starts <laughs> um, hallucinating animated horses and needs to go see a therapist. Whoa. She said lateral content. I did. <laughs> Wait, Joe, are you I done? just lose my mind. No, Rebecca's gonna do touch ups for me. Uh oh, he's Joe's Aww. getting. What'd you do to my couch? Oh, I mean, <laughs> you like move stuff around my couch. Also, I will address this now. A lot of people on Twitter have been asking about my couch and asking if it's just a small couch or low to the ground. I didn't think anything of it until I asked Rebecca. I was like, is my couch small? She was like, yes. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Anyways, it's just low to the ground. Everyone, chill out. A small, a little couch for a little boy. I'm just a little person. I'm just a little person, so I just need a little couch. That's a lot of food for a little boy. Forever. So, One of my favorite quotes. Oh, I'll tell this story. So Joshua Bassett. He orders the same thing every single time. And he has this one dish that he gets and he never finishes all the chicken that's on the thing. And I, so I kind of like always look over and I had said this for weeks. I was like, you know, that's a lot of food for a little boy. Like hoping he would say like, oh yeah, like here, did you want some? Um, yeah, never happened until finally. He would like, just be I like, just have a bite. Can I just have a bite and just know what it tastes like? <laughs> oh man. Josh, I back. miss him. I miss I know. everyone. Stream this common sense. Terrible. Yeah, common sense. common sense. Oh, Joe's off book. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So okay, Julia, what are you listening to? Any podcasts? Any music? What should what What's the haps? Literally, my life consists of YouTube and TikTok and Netflix. I, I don't get. Like oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, 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 go ahead. That's literally it. I'm the most boring human alive. Oh, no. I mean, I do the same <laughs> thing. But TikTok, I, like, don't get on it ever. And But then when I do, it's, like, four hours has gone by. And I'm, like, what just happened? It is soul-sucking. Um, yeah, it's kind of crazy. Honestly, honestly, I'm okay with the fact that I am so consumed with it during this quarantine. Like, we have nothing else to do. If you're going to lay around and be lazy, nothing. embrace it. Like, I am embracing the fact that I'm glued to my phone. It's fine. I'm just Same. nervous about going back to work and using TikTok as my Dr. Phil, 
Like, you know, the way that I like always watch Dr. Phil in between takes. I feel like I'm going to switch to TikTok now. <laughs> oh my God. I think TikTok um, is encouraging my attention. Um, I get distracted easily, you understand? Yes. And I think with how quickly it moves, it only makes it worse. Because mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, I need another thing. I need another thing. I need another thing to focus on. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I, can't, I can't read a chapter of a book without checking my phone, like, three times. That's horrible. Of course. Of course. I can. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're perfect. Sorry. I'm, I'm mm -hmm. sorry. Okay, so I did two coats on this one. Beautiful. One this one. Jude, you're I kind of it. like Thank you. pixelated. Really? Love touch ups. Yeah, love maybe it's my words. internet connection. I basically have AOL. Oh no, my uh, my AOL. Um, <laughs> my end looks clear. I don't know if anybody else can see. But I did my, I did both coats. Okay, I'm going to do one more and then I'm done. And then I love it. it looks I'll amazing. let you go forever. No, what am I, what am I going to go do, Frankie? <laughs> I don't know. Read a book. Is there a book you've been putting off? You know what? Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> Did I tell you about the like the that day I j I got my new book and I had made my coffee. I had like my little like coffee set up by my bed. I was so ready to go, <laughs> and I was trying to look at something on my phone while having my holding my coffee cup, and I spilled coffee all over my nightstand. It like got all over my book my phone, my computer, and then it sank into the drawer. So. Oh no. Yeah. Yikes. How was, was your bed covered in coffee? Yes, and it still is because I bounced. Oh, this was in Salt Lake? Yeah. So you just have coffee seeping into your mattress right now? Mm, that'd be correct, yes. Mm, I love that for you. Thank you. Honestly, though, I left, like, a lot of, like, produce in my fridge because I thought food. we would only be gone for a couple weeks. Dude, your house is rotten. I know. Like, <laughs> I have some pears that are probably, like... Oh, my gosh. Can you imagine the smell? I don't even want to think about it. I don't want to think about it. Oh, my God. I know. It's going to be a mess. It's See, I just don't eat vegetables altogether, and then you don't have that problem. There you go. Yeah, I should just stop eating veggies. That's perfect. Fitting. I had broccoli yesterday. I let <laughs> my, um, I had... oranges go bad. Oh, no. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. In your place? No, like, literally, I brought them home, and I let them go bad. I didn't eat them. Of course. What you you love cuties, huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but it has to be, like, a good one. Like, if it when they hit, they hit. When they don't. That is so accurate. It's like Slim Jims. I don't eat Slim Jims anymore, but last year, <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. Uh, <laughs> well, I'm brave. I'll talk about it. Okay. Uh, um, <laughs> there was one day Julia just looked at me. She was like, you ever eat a bad Slim Jim? I was like, what? And she was like, yeah, you know how like when you eat a Slim Jim and it kind of tastes like, what did you say, wood? Yeah, it's like wood, and you can taste like this is for sure a dead animal. <laughs> I was like, I've never thought about it, but yes, yes, I yeah. have eaten a bad Slim Jim. It's like when you eat a bad peanut M and M. Oh, they're sour. It's not good. No, not good at all. What is that? Um, Does that mean we have questions? Oh, I'm gonna oh, click on something, Juji. I'm live. <laughs> I hope it's I'm a live. Oh, what? I'm just gonna get my, my dad his computer really quick. Yeah, I'm gonna click this and see what happens. Oh, oh questions. they're questions. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, you guys. I didn't see this. Wow. Lots of questions. These are a lot of questions. Do any of you watch Brooklyn Nine Nine? No. No, but my friend does, and he said it's the best. Oh, ever. Can I sing for you? You can. Yes, please tag me. Is that Joe? Yes, it is. Yes, Joe. it is. I just it double checked. <laughs> um, just to let you know, Josh is my husband. Wow. I'm Brazil. You should probably, 
um, wow, this is so fun. Uh, okay, I'm gonna exit. Joe, how was University of Michigan? Sonia? Oh, it was wonderful. Joe, marry me. You got a marriage proposal. Whoa. Wow. Can't say I've gotten one. <laughs> Um, all right, I am done. Yes, you are. Look at us, metallic gods. We started this live without any nail polish on our nails, and we ended it with nail polish on our nails. Also, all over our nails, all over the table, all over the paper towels we laid out, nail polish is everywhere. 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 Yeah. Are you proud of them? I'm honestly, I feel like it's pretty dark in here, so I'm going to turn on the lights, and it's just going to be. It's just a mess. It's like when I do my makeup in the dark and then I turn on the lights and I'm like orange or um, yes. like too bronzed. But Absolutely. You know what? we live, we learn, and we're here for um, I saw, okay, I'm referencing a TikTok. I, you know, this is the world we live in now. Um, did you know that Picasso died in the 70s? The 1970s? Like the painter? Yeah. What, what, what's your point? I thought he lived in like the 1600s, <laughs> 1700s. This man died when my parents were teenagers. Damn. I guess that is pretty crazy, huh? Like, why have I never seen pictures of him that aren't like... Like oil paintings? <laughs> yeah! Think about it! It's crazy. Um... <laughs> <laughs> think about it. <laughs> anyway, that's a little fun fact for you. Frankie, your eyebrows look dope. Thank you. I yes, grow them myself. <laughs> All right, Juji. I am Dunzo. Me as well. Joe, nail check. Nail check. All right, let's do a final look through. Let's do a fashion show. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, we should like catwalk our nails. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Go to off. Yes. Ooh, that drippage. Go they off. Look terrible. <laughs> they look amazing. Look at my thumbs. Rebecca, okay. Yes. Go ahead. Oh yeah. Go ahead, Joe. Okay, here's mine. Okay. I love that <laughs> color. <laughs> so pretty. Thanks. He said Sharpay. And then we have okay. Rebecca's. Here's mine. Yes. <gasps> yes. Hers oh, look like nails. professional. <laughs> yeah, why is you, why do your nails look like gels? Oh, thanks. <laughs> They're so healthy looking. They're Thank all you. All right, Juji, let's see it. Ooh. Wow. So what's your pattern here? So we did, we did like a three and a two. So three green, two gunmetal, two green, three gunmetal. Yes. Oh my yeah. gosh. That's pretty fun. I'm quirky. I'm zany. It's not a big deal. I'm quirky. What's that? <laughs> what's the song with zany in the word? In the. But the world is full of zanies and fools. Why isn't that <laughs> on Disney Plus though? This Brandy Cinderella. I love that. I grew up on that movie. What? Disney, I, yeah. if you can hear me, upload that song. Guys, that that movie, movie was so ahead of its time. You have to hear Frankie sing um, "Falling in Love with Love." <gasps> okay, so when I was little, I would check out the VHS tape of Cinderella, mm -hmm. and I would just play the Bernadette Peters falling in love with love, and I memorized exactly, like, when she would turn over the chair, when she would pick up the pillow, when she would throw it out, the hair tosses. That was my first introduction to Bernadette Peters, and I was like, who is this fabulous human being? Absolutely. And I can picture you doing it. Yeah, I tried um, to recreate it the other day, but Joe just laughed at me. He doesn't respect doesn't art. doesn't mean I didn't like no. it. I, that means I enjoyed it. <laughs> um, I would pay to see that, so. I think you'd be very upset and ask for your money back. <laughs> mm -hmm. I gotcha. There's Honestly, and everything. Of course there is. I don't expect anything less from Frankie. Yeah. Um. <laughs> But I do feel bad for kids who didn't grow up on that movie. Because that was like, my parents were like, this is Cinderella. And like, that's what I grew up like knowing as this mm -hmm. tale of Cinderella and whatever. So, Can I yeah, Disney Plus needs to put that up. What? I've never seen it, that, that version of Cinderella. I've never seen it. 
Okay. Well. So, are we finding a new Seb? Or... <laughs> no. Like Dylan Sprouse. Oh my god! I'm actually so surprised. I feel like you I out know, of all people. I mean, I know like certain songs, like certain you know versions. I've seen like YouTube yeah. videos of it, but I've not seen it. Wow! I we need, need to change though. that. I've seen like every other freaking version. What other version? Yeah. Is there? Oh, there's so like, many Cinderella movies. Cinderella story. Another Cinderella story. Oh my god. <laughs> another <laughs> another Cinderella story. I love the Cinderella story. I just watched um, that, that movie too. Is that on Disney Plus? Mm -hmm. Oh, thank goodness. I love that movie. Mm -hmm. Jennifer. It's not on Disney Plus. It's on Netflix. Because I for sure. Oh, whoa, whoa. Wait, was it Disney? I'm assuming it was because it's Cinderella and Hillary Duff. Hillary Duff, yeah. But, why am I even asking? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. The Jennifer Coolidge when she's like, oh, she's like, oh Sam. I like when she goes, you're not very bright. <laughs> no. You're not very pretty. <laughs> so good. All right. I'm done. Um, I'm going to wrap this up. Thank you for yes. everyone who tuned in. Like the... Like a lot of you tuned in. That's so nice. Thank you. I know. Um, we might have to do I this. I hope everyone's nails turned out okay. I know. You. I'm gonna post something on Twitter that says like, "Show me your nails," and then everybody upload your photo there so I can see. Yeah. Cute. Yeah. It's gonna be fun. Cute. All right, and I'll and then I'll show you what these look like in normal lighting. Juji, I love you. Thank you so much for doing this with us. I love you guys. Thank you for asking me. I'm so honored. Of course. Um, Shall we? <laughs> I love you, Juji. I love I, you guys. I hope to see you soon. Please be happy and safe and healthy. And yes. that goes for everyone. Um, yeah. I'll, you guys too. I love you. I love you, Rebecca. I, I don't know how to. Am I'll I end it myself? and then maybe it'll end. But if it's just you, right. right, then you have to say wondering. Yeah. Okay. You got it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love you. I love everyone. you guys. Bye, everyone. Mwah, 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 mwah.